my dear neat 2026 aspirants this is your captain stress and if you are serious about the next year's neat then you should definitely avoid these three mistakes and if you are on the channel for even some decent time you already know that whatever we have been saying and predicting you know has happened whether it is the paper pattern whether it is the optional section being removed or whether the timing of the examination being reduced back to 3 hours or even the syllabus and even the difficulty level of the examination considering all the things that have happened right now and you know the sadness which is still there in many neat aspirants the paper level and the difficulty and the rank inflation last year you better listen to these three things because that can definitely save your neat 2026 so i have been training mentoring kids for a very long time and now that you are here with me it's my responsibility that i ensure that whatever happens with you you know it happens under supervision so that you are taken care of till the very end so you better stay subscribed on the channel by hitting the subscribe and of course uh, please word a thanks by smashing that like button let's start with the first one now the most important thing is the syllabus completion versus practice and it might seem like a small thing but many neat students just target completing the syllabus they just think about completing the syllabus maybe by february or even sometimes march and you feel that two months one month three months are enough that is definitely not right ideally if you are a long term student preparing for two years and all you should be done by october but i do understand that there are a lot of 12th standard students who just started practice or maybe you are a dropper student in that situation my dear students at least try to cover it up by november worst case scenario december first half that is your ultimate deadline to complete complete your entire 11th as well as the 12th syllabus because you need those two rounds of bare minimum revision before your final neat exam ideal will be three rounds which starts maybe from december to february the first round then february to march the second round and april the third round in fact there is a fourth round which happens very fast within just 4 or 5 days it's called as the final lab so when you undergo these final revisions that's when you should you would be confident of the neat examination okay so target november and max december first half and of course this is what gets left out when i say you have to complete the syllabus you watch all the classes you make your notes you are going through the theory points you are reading ncert again and again you are doing all these things but what takes a back seat is the practice if you are not practicing no matter how much you do it's of no use i can watch cooking recipes all day i can watch the best chef videos no matter what i can join the best batch the chef might be in front of me but until i turn on the stove i mix the ingredients i will never learn same applies to any kind of exam preparation so please hold your pen remove the rough sheets waste many pages redo until you get it right do it again if you have done a mistake this practice is what many students lack and i will give you a target at least solve 50 to 60 questions mcqs i am saying per day at least and not just from bio okay it should be a mix start with that you will slowly reach up to 100 every day and that will build into an habit promise me that you are going to do it please don't let the practice go away yes syllabus completion should happen hand in hand the second biggest mistake tell me if you make this sir i have made beautiful notes sir you know x institute the topper all in the rank one i got their notes sir i got on telegram you know these amazing things over here sir you know i am making my own notes see so many colors i have used so many charts i have used very good great but just because your notes are beautiful or you have got the best notes from here and there does not mean you will score well and how many times it has happened with you only you might have researched like crazy you have made beautiful notes but 
in the exam the marks did not reflect that well in fact the answer lies in the previous slide only which is practice so making notes is not the top priority if you get the toppers notes very well and good but you should be able to understand number two don't waste too much time making notes many you know things are there in the market these days you get those flashcards you get those mind maps right you can just download or you can buy it off in fact when you have the physical hard copy it's very easy because these days note making is no longer an art rather it has been already mastered by many of the institutes or maybe even people and they directly give you those flashcards or those mind maps or those formula sheets just use it as it is it's not like only if i make it through my hand i will be the best see now you don't have time because barely few months are there if you're a two-year student i would be like yeah fine start making it from the scratch okay you better save that time and utilize it for more and more practice and many kids just keep reading reading watching reading watching multiple times but again that notes and just theory is never never enough ultimately it has to come to solving mcqs and then ultimately to timed practice and then finally to the mock tests so there are multiple stages of practice one you are just you know with a with a free mind and an open mind without any timer you are understanding concepts you are substituting values you are understanding the reactions mechanisms the theory where it is from etc then you slowly you know push yourself to complete couple of questions in a set of time then you actually give the class test there you test with others and then you go to the all india level test series and all of that so that is how you should progress is this clear if you're not doing it 100 percent you need to rectify it now that is why i have made this video third important thing sir is ncrt pyqs and watching je classes enough first of all is ncrt enough no but ncrt is mandatory you have to go through it at least two three times especially for biology very important physics okay one or two times you go through it properly chemistry at least the inorganic part you should have gone through it and maybe a little bit of organic and physical but it is definitely not enough considering the difficulty of the paper sir what about pyqs if you check the last few year pyqs very simple go to the old pyqs maybe look at afmc ames papers uh, Jipmer papers and you know the old neat questions that is what you need go back to 20 years 30 years use those pyqs that is the real test sir because the difficulty has increased so should i watch je classes see je classes usually you know most of them you will see that will be writing mains but when a je lecture is being conducted it is taught with the perspective of advanced questions in mind and advance is a very different ball game some of you will be like, sir, one question of advanced game in J, uh, sorry, need this year. See, that is one and off. It's not like 100 questions will come of very high level. And even that question can be solved by using some logic. So you don't really have to watch JE classes because the methodology, the perspective is completely different. There we assume that students know mathematics and in need we understand that students wouldn't take mathematics so seriously or would have left it as an optional subject and the whole perspective the methodology pedagogy is completely different so no need to watch J classes watch need classes only but watch of proper teachers proper lectures which are now at higher level check the teacher traditions they should themselves be especially for physics and chemistry they should at least be msc uh, or you know from iit nit something like that if not then the teacher themselves cannot scale you up understand that because the level is quite good and normal uh, you know teachers may not be able to scale you scale it up sorry to say this because till this time after covid the papers were very easy anybody could get good marks but still getting a good rank at the end of the day was up to speed so please watch quality classes okay and not just j but neat classes only and solve older pyqs and go through decent rounds of ncrt but you'll have to use some coaching module practice books etc if you want i can make a separate video on that sir can you help me with all of this well 
some of you might already know we have the doctor need aspirants batch which is called a dna batch for the entire syllabus coverage by the month of november december along with revision multiple rounds mock test series class tests and it's a pure english batch and you have your teachers with your amazing pro teachers and the offline teachers taking care of the entire syllabus now this batch not only gives you those live classes and those dpps and the assignments and the coaching modules and the class tests everything but apart from that students now get the flashcards for you know quick revision these are like memory flashcards with diagrams formula sheets cheat codes everything in pocket size pocket friendly cards which you can carry it anywhere and revise multiple times so you get it couriered at your doorstep and you also get the test series online plus a separate AITS 180 which is nothing but a collection of the best tests full as well as part tests in the offline pen and paper format along with the OMR sheet everything is courier to you because the final paper is a pen and paper mode so you will get the real feel of the examination that is also courier at your doorstep based on the current neat 2026 pattern and to top it all you also get the additional coaching module which is the tatwa module again delivered at your doorstep it's not just one book it's a collection of 20 plus books which is again given to you it has lot of numericals level 1 2 3 exercises it has pyqs also it has theory also at the beginning which is very concise and also beyond ncert so that is the tatwa book which is also given to you in the dna batch so how to join the dna batch the link is there in the description box of this video make the best offer make the best use of it and do not think sir i have missed few classes what about that you will not only get the replays but whatever you have missed will be covered at the end in the terms of one shot live so technically you are not missing any live so you are getting the replays and it is also covered after november so syllabus is completed on time it's not your headache it's our headache and it's our responsibility to make sure you become a doctor so check out the link and i hope you understood what are the three mistakes which every student should avoid okay so the link will be here something like that the dna batch for 2026 and you can see you know there will be different versions this is just the prime version with all the classes and everything online but some kids would love the quick revision cards and the test series okay so that is the mid version and this is the ultimate version with the batch with the quick revision with the test series and the tatwa module okay for 10999 all of you so i hope you avoid all these three mistakes and all the best for your future this was your captain shreyas signing off bye bye